Hi, I'm Onisa Klein here at the GBTA Broadcast Studio. It's great to be here and with me today, all the way in from London, is Matteo De Renzi, who is the Business to Business Marketplace Managing Director of GET. Welcome, Matteo. Welcome, Monique. Thanks. Thank you so much for being with us, especially after a long flight. And it sounds like you've done some business already here in the U.S. and North Indeed. America, which is great, as one should do. So it's wonderful to have you here. So welcome. Thank you for having me. So first off, tell us about Get. Tell us there there might be some people that are not familiar with your company. So if you can maybe um, expand a little bit on what Get does, and Ladies that'd be great. And Get is a, uh, is a software platform for management of ground transportation for corporate, corporates. Okay. We um, offer ground transportation services through our ground transportation marketplace all over the world, meaning that uh, we can offer you all type of cars and vehicles uh, anywhere you need uh, for your company. We aggregate together all different type of uh, uh, partner fleets. We can offer you license taxis, e-hailing provider, black cars, limos, and any other variant that uh, your company might need. It's a very, very big market. It's, a, it's an industry worth uh, globally around uh, 100 billion company. And, uh, and it's an industry which is uh, still in, uh, if you want, in, in their early stage of, of development. A lot of effort has gone into uh, the corporate travel in managing flights, hotels, mm -hmm. and other type of costs. But we think that not a lot has gone yet in managing ground transportation. So this is what we do. Excellent. How long has Get been around? Well, Get started in 2011. 2011. So we have some, okay. some history behind okay, us. Okay, great. And um, we started, uh, as uh, many others, uh, being a B2C player in uh, London, UK, then Israel, Russia. We then became uh, more and more a corporate B2B player, okay. offering uh, our taxes to corporates. Interesting enough, our very first client was Google in Israel. And then we saw this uh, opportunity to help uh, many other players to, to serve their own customers, their corporate customers, aggregating them all together. And that's where this idea of building this marketplace, this software platform that can connect customers and fleets, and uh, well, this is when this idea came out. So our, our value proposition is uh, making all this uh, ecosystem work efficiently. We save companies 25 to 49% of their cost, which is significant, mm -hmm. particularly in these days when many of, uh, com many of the companies are rethinking their way of procuring travel yeah. after the horrible years we had behind us. So it's a perfect opportunity to, uh, to help them to start with a new and fresh approach to, to this industry. Right, and I think people are willing to try new and different things now, right? More so than ever before, right? They are. It, especially if there's a value proposition involved, so it's very good. So tell me how Get is uh, different from the other players in the market. What, di what differentiates you from the others? It's a good question. and. Um, I think that uh, there are a few things that makes it, makes us different. First, um, as I said before, we are a software platform. We don't own cars. We don't operate cars. We don't employ drivers. We are a connector. We really help the customers to, to make the best choice and the fleets to have their best, cust the best customers available to them. So the, the main difference is that uh, with all other providers, you basically, every time you book a car, you basically have their cars. With our solution, you can have all the cars in the world available to you, oh, within, right. uh, within, uh, within the remit of our own partners. First number one. Uh, uniqueness number two is that uh, we are focused on helping companies in being more efficient. We don't negotiate on their behalf rates. We don't force suppliers on, on uh, you know, rate cards that they don't feel appropriate or they cannot live with. We, we leave that cost untouched and we just work on optimizing the use of those services for the corporate. So we really try to be a force for good between these two without creating any no separation or no conflict between, between these two worlds. We are an enabler 
in okay. many ways, if you want. Uh, earlier you mentioned several countries that you were um, present in. Do you have any clients in the U.S. today? We have clients in the U.S. Okay. And um, we, we have um, uh, what we call, a, <coughs> bless you, we have what we call a playbook for launch. And we're actually launching in the U.S. Now, literally, okay. in, in these days, uh, which is which is pretty exciting. Um, so we normally start offering first. We build uh, this uh, transportation grid of partners that are ready to accept orders coming from our clients. That's step number one, and that's what we have done in the last uh, few months, despite the pandemic and all that complexity. And today. We already have on our platform more than 1,700 fleets all over wow. the world. Up to, I know it sounds incredible, 3 million drivers. So, you know, it, it gives you a sense of the, of the scale the of, of yeah. the potential and the scope. So the first step is we build this transportation grid. Then next step, we start bringing uh, international traffic. So this uh, roaming, which fortunately now in the US since November 8th, is yes. possible again. Yes. So we literally had already in these days uh, uh, an incredible surge of demand of people landing from, from UK, rest of Europe, uh, Israel and Russia to the, to the US. And that's the second step. Then the, the third step is uh, when, uh, when a very large enterprise of ours starts adopting our solution also locally. It can be a big bank or a big consulting firm or a big law firm that is a client of ours in UK, Israel, or Russia. And then they start using our solution also for the New York office or Denver office mm. or San Francisco office. And then last step that will come later, we, uh, we're going to start helping also local American companies for local, for local needs in order to optimize uh, their spend. As I said before, without having any controversial approach. Uh, as we always say, we don't come to you know, disrupt, uh, break, uh, rebuild. We, we come to organize and help. Great. Well, what's been the response so far from the customers that you have talked to and have met with? What's, what's the response been? The response is, uh, is uh, you know, it, it, it's very encouraging and uh, in, in some elements extremely positive. Okay, good. And uh, we see uh, adoption, which is the most important thing for us, the, the solution being used. We, we have uh, on our, you know, as many other players, at the end of the ride, we ask you to give us a rating. And uh, we have a rating in, ex in excess of 4.5 stars out of five. So uh, clearly, uh, you know, the, the service once it's used is appreciated. We had very good response from our partner fleets. Many of them I met in these days here in the US, finally, face to face, which is great because they see the potential of yeah. this platform to help them yes. to win more business and streamline their processes. And I cannot hide the fact that uh, you might have seen in the news, but uh, last week we recently announced uh, that we, we're going to go public. We're going to become a public company through uh, a merge with uh, uh, Roscliffe Corporation through a SPAC process. So that alone has created a lot of momentum and interest for what we're doing, which kind of built up on, on, on the overall thing. So perfect time for us, perfect time, I think, for the industry to rethink the way people move around. And uh, yeah, very excited about the future. And a perfect opportunity to be here at the GBTA convention, right? Where you have the opportunity to meet with many buyers that are here and suppliers and uh, a lot of people that are in the business travel industry. So it's great to see. It's great to see uh, people around, and uh, you know, when when he when he tells the story, we see in the eyes of, of of the people that it makes sense. Yes. Because you offer a great experience to to the buyer, which ultimately is the person in charge of uh, bringing the solution in the company. Yes. You offer a great experience to the employee because then he or she now has everything in, in his or her hand available. You offer a great experience to bookers to simplify their right. life, admin, finance, HR. And then, uh, you know, it's, it's really a solution that uh, we, are, we are very positive about. That's great. Going forward. Well, Matteo, congratulations. It sounds like there's a lot of things, positive and exciting things happening at Get. 
and it's wonderful to have you here at the convention and thank you so much for uh, joining me today. Thank you for having all me. All the best, all the best for the, the week ahead. Okay, thank you. Thank you. I'm Monisa Klein here at the GBTA Broadcast Studio.